Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Let's Play God of War. When we left off, we were just about to get into a fight with the... Ooh, let's call him Steve. Uh, Steve is a pretty straightforward boss, our first in the game. Uh, he starts off with a two or three hit combo. Really easy to just roll to his side after every hit, and you can even fit swings in between uh, each of the hits. So you can just react if he does the third instead of ending with the second one. Also, we get to finally see Atreus in the heat of a fight, and he is really dope. Uh, he'll, if you're not actively using him, he'll jump on enemies and grapple them, and there are upgrades for him. Hit him with the bow, try to do combos on him, uh, and then if you just mash square, he'll fire arrows. So Atreus is literally just your ebony and ivory button. Uh, so starting from that halfway mark on his health bar, he'll enter phase two, start doing this flailing attack with that totem, or that big stake of wood, whatever that is. Uh, it seems to have some etchings in it. And he will also stomp the ground and roar and do a, like, a tiny sliver of damage to push you away, just so we can start a new series of attacks up if he wants. Uh, I believe that if you get hit by that while the, the stake is glowing, it can also uh, catch you on fire, but I, I, it's been a long time since one of those has hit me, so can't remember exactly. Straightforward fight, though. Really showed Steve who's boss. Wouldn't be God of War without one of those. That didn't go so well. I mean, we beat. The path home is this way. We beat Steve really easily, but uh, Atreus is showing some signs of the old Kratos, the one we know and kind of despise. And Kratos seems real dismayed at that sight. Also, there's some mention of Atreus not having been sick in a while. Hmm. In the meantime, Jesus, that's always so good feeling. We'll have to see what's up with that in time. Also, we'll have to see what's up with that door. And ever since we got the big cinematic execution uh, on Steve, this bar below the health bar has been appearing, and that is a stun gauge which allows you to perform those kills on any enemy. Still can't get the doors open, huh? Quiet. New hidden location. Uh, we don't have the tool that we need to open those up yet, and we won't be getting that for a very, very long time. this nicely. Uh, the axe does have kind of a uh, projectile uh, trajectory to it where it will drop over distances. Uh, 
Oh. Didn't quite parry that in time. So the uh, the cinematic executions in this act a little bit like uh, glory kills in Doom, uh, more so than the uh, the grapples or the uh, circle prompts in previous God of Wars. And this dude is brand new, the Ice Draugr. Uh, see, we took a couple of shots at him with the Leviathan Axe, which is usually ice enchanted, and it did nothing. God, we're going to see a lot of that animation, and that's fine because it's one of my favorite kills. And I told you not to speak. So yeah, the Axe will not work so well on that enemy type. Silent. We are almost home. Inside, boy. Why did I expect it to be any different now that she's... You lost control. That thing was trying to kill us. It's not like you don't get anger in a fight. Anger can be a weapon. If you control it, use it. You clearly cannot. When you... I haven't been sick in a long time. I'm better now. Fine. Come on, then. You want me to hit you? I want you to try. Ow! What are you... Try again. Why are you doing that? Too slow. Try again. Cut it out! Weak. Again. Again! Stop it! Again! <laughs> in it. That ahead is difficult. And you, Atreus, are clearly not ready. What was that? Quiet. Come on out! There's no use hiding anymore. I know who you are. What's going on? Do you know him? More importantly, I know what you are. Boy, beneath the floor. Now. But you told me never to go down there. Who is that? I do not know. What's he talking about? I do not know. Get in. Just tell me what I want to know. No need for this to get bloody. I 
thought you'd be bigger. But you're definitely the one. Long way from home, aren't you? What do you want? Oh, you already know the answer to that. Whatever it is you seek, I do not have it. You should move on. <laughs> and here I thought your kind was supposed to be so enlightened, so much better than us, so much smarter. And yet you hide out here in the woods like a coward. You do not want this fight. Oh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I do. Leave my home. You are going to have to kill me for that to happen. I warned you. Finally. You would not listen. No, 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 no. No, no, no. no. Fine. My turn. Come on, then. <laughs> Yo, the stranger is so cool. <laughs> it's all fights the dopest. Ah! <laughs> this is so good. Oh, there's a video where somebody dubs over the music for this whole scene with Kuze's theme in Yakuza Zero, and it works so well. He's even got the badass. A uh, Yakuza Lieutenant tattoos. And then you send him flying through trees. Like this whole thing is a... Oh, look how cool he moves. This whole thing is like a big uh, comic book superhero fight. It's like a Dragon Ball fight, actually. <laughs> so good. Ah! <laughs> oh, there's... I really hope we get the specific parry animation I'm looking for. We almost got it there. But there's one where he, he mm, sends him all the way across the arena like that. And all the stuff. Oh! This is so good. Yeah, it's not all subdued. Nah, it's not all subdued. <laughs> Some of it's just hype as shit like this. <laughs> yeah! So good! Struck a nerve, did I? Slow and old, you should never have come to Midgard. So, care to try again? You talk too much. <laughs> Won't talk? Fine. Maybe whoever it is you got stashed in that house with. And this is just introducing good old Spartan Rage, Rage of the Gods, whatever. Except now it changes our move set. Who is Who are you afraid of? Fine. Let's 
So, while we're in Rage of the Gods, uh, that new bar appears under our health. It'll activate as we fight, or it will fill up as we fight, and we can activate it once it's past a certain threshold, and it gives us this as our R2 now, and this as our R1. Uh, and if a target is airborne, we'll jump into the sky and knock him to the ground. Uh, and also, it will replenish your health with each hit. Is the dopest. You want some hype sauce to just pour on your boss fight? Make him move like an anime character and do wrestling moves. Shit, it's so good. I don't have time for this. Ah, not quite. I want to bounce him back off the shield. Happened on my first playthrough, and it was the sickest. That shockwave is an amazing effect. And back home we go, bloodied and fatigued. Leaving so soon? Psych. Test of strength! Split in the earth! Ah! So good! You've seen it with your own eyes. You can't hurt me. Nothing can. This fight is pointless. Your struggle is pointless. Didn't have to be this way. Pathetic. You can't win. I feel nothing, but you—you you feel everything. Yet you—you you keep trying. I'm not my brother, and if you'd given me what I wanted, it wouldn't have ended this way. But no. Let's finish this. That's so amazingly fast. So all we know about this dude is that he's dope as hell, and he is completely impervious to damage, and he feels nothing that we're doing to him. Ugh. And he gets a couple of new things now. Uh, his little anime table hopper move uh, moves a little bit differently now so you can't quite dodge the same way as before uh, and he has that shock like there's a little bit more zigging and zagging to it and he has that new shockwave move this one the death from above But we can juggle him, at least for a single combo. Like, we're doing real damage, the problem is none of it's gonna take. 
And that seems to just be a general godhood thing, because Kratos healed his wounds the same way just now. <laughs> and he has a kick off of it, too. Uh, that kick when he lands, I think he can send you across the arena and through the trees just like you can do to him. It's like such a ridiculously hype thing to be happening 45 minutes into the game. And uh, that's going to do it. Thank you all for watching. Take it easy. Have a good one.